Today's episode is all about old cats and this is our old boy Kevin. Kevin's 15 years old and he's a domestic short hair. Isn't he beautiful? Now Kevin is outside and he's allowed outside because he's always been outside but these days he doesn't get much further than our front doorstep or our back doorstep. We can always find him. Where are you going now Kevin? Come back here. They say don't work with kids and animals. So, as I was saying, Kevin is always at the back door or front door and contained to our property. He spends most of his time inside, but enjoys a little outdoor freedom as well. Old cats need a little extra consideration, just like older humans. Enriching their lives is important and easier than you think. They need lots of love and attention and it's important to pay attention to their behaviour, as this can give you some good indications of what they need. Kevin gets fed on the bench in our laundry area. It keeps the food off the floor and away from Bonnie the dog who will happily scoff it down if given the chance. We have added steps to near the bench to make it easier for him to get up to his food. This gives him a little extra exercise and it's a challenge with a reward at the end. Kevin is still quite playful and he loves the red dot toy. Just like people, older cats need to be kept mentally and physically stimulated. They might not play like they used to, but they need to use it or they will lose it. While some older cats will still play, some will need a little bit of encouragement to move around. Cats love boxes, so we often just stack a few around for them to play in. Our younger cat adores Kevin and Kevin will often play with the younger cats. Sometimes just sitting back and watching and other times he'll join in the fun. Enrichment can be as simple as different smells, textures and objects. Putting treats in some of their favourite areas for them to find, like a treasure hunt. A paper bag that they can explore and sit on for the old timers can give them some mental stimulation. Talk with your vet to see what your cat can still do. Cat trees that have an easy way for cats to get up and down them and shelves to get up higher and steps of any kind can be great to give that extra bit of exercise. Kevin loves our window shelves and this cat tree makes it easier for him and some of the other older cats to get to this prime spot. This is valuable real estate in our house. Mostly these days, Kevin likes to sleep. Cats spend around 16 hours a day sleeping and as they get older, this can increase. Any change in behavior is a good indication that age is setting in. It can be a puzzle sometimes that you may have to solve so understanding what is usual behaviour and not normal behaviour is paramount. I talk a lot about containing your cat. It's contained cats that are much easier to see issues with and you can monitor them much better than cats that roam. So here are some of my top tips for looking after an older cat. Look out for changes in habits. Particularly beware of changes in weight. This is an easy one to spot. If the weight goes up or down enough for you to notice, then it could be signs of an issue. This is medical and needs to be discussed with your vet. Pay attention to the litter box. Litter boxes can tell us a lot about a cat's health. Lots of urine combined with lots of drinking of water can indicate issues that should be checked out by a vet. So use the litter box to keep an eye on your old cat's health. As your cats get older, their needs will change and the biggest, most wonderful thing you can do for an aging cat is work out what those changing needs are. If they're finding it hard to get up on the couch, look at getting a ramp or some small steps to help them get to where they wanna be. Make sure that you keep a good eye on their habits and look out for any changes in those. To finish off this episode, I'm gonna show you some photographs of Kevin that we've taken of him over the last 15 years so you can see just how much he's changed from being such a little baby boy into the old fella that he is now. 